In this video, I will discuss how to use the Add Grid at Selected Point option here in SAP 2000. So in this model, perhaps it was imported from a DXF file or any other source but didn't have the grid lines associated with it. It would take quite a bit of time to actually find the X, Y, and Z coordinates for this uh, little more complicated model. And that's where the Add Grids at Selected Points comes into play. By simply Selecting one or more point objects in the model, as I'm doing here, I can go to the Edit menu, Edit Points, Add Grids at Selected Points. Here you'll access the Add Grid Lines at Selected Points form and add grid lines in the current coordinate or grid system. You can use these options on the form to specify the new grid lines to be parallel to the X, Y, or Z axis in the current coordinate system and a new grid line will be added to each selected point. So in this case, why don't we select orientation for constant Z. So as you can see here, grid lines have been applied at the Z coordinate for the selected point objects. 